Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. Today's video is going to be my spring Easter tablescape. Yay! I am super excited about this video and showing you guys what I came up with, but I am extra excited because this video is a collaboration with my new friend, Miss Ida over at Design on a Dollar. Hey, Ida. Ida is the queen of DIYs. If you guys have not seen her channel, I, I don't know what y'all waiting for. You guys need to just go on over there, baby, because she is the bling queen. She will blink it out. Do you hear me? Yes. So go over there, check out Ida's channel, and please let her know that Miss Fee Marie sent you, okay? So spring, you guys, is one of my favorite seasons. Um, the only thing I don't like is the allergies. I, I promise you guys, the allergies have been awful since we've had an early spring. But other than that, I love that everything is turning green, that all the vibrant colors are coming out. I absolutely love it. So this tablescape is definitely near and dear to my heart. I hope you guys will enjoy it as much as I enjoyed bringing it to you. If you are new here, I hope you will hit that subscribe button and come back for more videos. So, y'all want to see my spring tablescape? Keep on watching. So guys, here is my spring and Easter tablescape. I really love the way it turned out. And what I'll do is I will go and I will take it like step by step, guys, what I did and if you guys want to know where everything came from, I can also let you know that. Okay. So let's walk around to the center of the table. Okay, so I have the centerpiece, which was a DIY. I'll tell you guys all about that. It was really, really simple. Okay, and then it's really all about the bunnies. I got um, two of the taller bunnies and then two of the medium sized ones. And then I also added um, some little nests with some Easter eggs in it. The two bigger bunnies came from Ross for $11.99. Okay, sorry, my cell phone going off. Okay, so the big bunny with the gold ears, this one came from Ross for $11.99. Um, the nest, they came from Bell's Outlet for five, I think they were like five bucks, $5.99 or $4.99. I got the smaller bunnies, if you guys remember my haul from the Target uh, Bullseye Playground, and they were $3. And they also have the little gold on their ears. I'm not sure if you guys can see that. You would swear that the two of these were bought together, but they weren't. And I just have the exact same thing on the other side, okay? Um, this centerpiece was a DIY project, and I'm sorry you guys, I did not film it, but it's pretty simple. All the flowers are from Michaels. Right now they have everything 50% um, off, so if you need silk flowers, now is the best time to get them. I am in love with the hydrangea and the pennies, and I love the um, multicolored roses that are in there, so I absolutely love this centerpiece. Um, I actually made this from four of the Dollar Tree candlesticks, um, and I just bonded those together, along with, um, there is a, decor there's like a acrylic salad bowl in the party section of the Dollar Tree, that's where the bowl actually came from. And I just spray painted it together and came up with this centerpiece and I'm really happy with how it turned out. Hopefully you guys like it as well. Okay, so let's talk about these place settings. Okay, so the placemat came from where the Dollar Tree. Most of this, you guys will see the, the placemat and both plates are both from the Dollar Tree. The napkin is from Home Goods. The tumbler is from Home Goods. And if you guys remember, once again from my Target One Spot Spring Haul, I got the napkin rings from Target. Okay? 
So that is everything. And I really want to keep it simple when it comes to the place setting because, you know, my kids, they still come in here. So, you know, although they're bigger, I just don't want too many things on it for them to knock off. If you guys know what I mean, my mommy's out there. Okay, and so for the head table, I did it a little bit different. Okay, so for the head table, the napkin is a little different. I did the one here with the little um, lace detail on the trim. Okay, same um, napkin ring and placemat. But then the tumbler, I changed into to this wine glass. So in the same family, but just a little different. I wanted to make the head of the table a little different okay and so let's take one more look at what I came up with for my spring tablescape I really had fun putting this together you guys you know I'm very simple I like to keep it simple but I definitely want it to be seasonal and very festive so as I've said in some of my previous videos, the Robin's Egg Blue has showed up all over my house this spring, so I'm really embracing it. I think it's a beautiful color. Hopefully you guys will think so too. So I really hope you guys enjoyed my spring tablescape 2017. I wanna thank Ida again over at Design on a Dollar for doing this collaboration with me. I hope you will all run over to her channel and show her some love. And guys, as always, thank you so much for watching. I will see you all in my next video. Miracles and blessings, friends.